Welcome, welcome. I'm Donna G. Berry, the original creator of the Folk Art One Stroke Painting Technique. I created this technique many years ago, and it is taking a multi load with a paintbrush, putting more than one color on this brush at one time, and with pressure. And I push and lift and meld the colors together. And you can blend, shade, and highlight in each stroke. Now, the key to what I'm doing is I'm using an amazing paint. Um, the paint company I work with, um, who is a plaid, has these multi-surface paints. Now, I use plaid acrylic paints and chalk paints and fabric ink, uh, fabric creations, fabric inks for fabrics um enamel glass paint but the beauty about this one hello hello the beauty about this paint is it goes on multiple surfaces just like the name glass metal ceramic wood indoor outdoor canvas um lots of things that and i'm going to be painting on paper today but what i wanted you to understand is that it's got a sealer inside of it so it is wonderful wonderful all right so now this works I was here for a while and nobody was here. So thank you for coming on. It's nice to have you guys on. I'm going to paint a witch's hat today and I'm going to put all kinds of added elements on it to make it fun for you. Uh, a couple of things I want to go over with you is that we're doing um, YouTube live once a week. I'm trying to do it around Friday or Saturday depending on if I'm in town or if it's a crazy schedule. I do have a couple of things I want to share with you right off the bat. Um, one thing is, if you want to know, so many people say, you know, how do I find out where you are, when you're on, where I can take a lesson? Um, I have a studio in Orlando, Florida, and Groveland, Florida, actually right outside of Orlando. And every Tuesday, if you happen to come to Florida, come take a free class on a Tuesday. Make reservations with us so we'll know you're there. Um, and I teach those live on Tuesdays when I'm not traveling. And so what I want to share with you is to find out all those elements about One Stroke is where I show it all, where I show what's on One Stroke Advantage on YouTube and where I show that I'm going to be live and where I do Patreon and what's going on for the month, my calendars and much more and meet wonderful. We have almost 40,000 people that are dedicated one stroke painters, beginners and, and instructors. So to get to my Facebook uh, website, it's a private site. So you're welcome to join, but this is what's been happening. A whole bunch of YouTube people are going on and they don't answer any questions. Well, because it's a private site, you can't get on until you answer the questions. So instead of having to email everybody to tell them that, please, when you go on, please answer the questions because um, the we want, it kind of tells you the rules of what's going on and what you're allowed to do and not do. So I wanted to share that with you. And it's Donna Dewberry's official, because so many people have done oh, one stroke sites um donna dewberry's official one stroke group and so when you do that on facebook um go look for me and come join me all right that would make it really good for you if you're interested at all if you want to become a teacher if you want to know more we've got wonderful people on here that will help you and encourage you along with me uh um well thank you i've got the same shirt on i wore earlier today but what I wanted you to see is I hand painted on this. This shirt's kind of fun because it says together we are one. And um, that's backwards. <laughs> but I think that's backwards. But y'all have to tell me um, if it says it right or not right. I'm always having to flip this around. But what I want to share with you next, you guys tell me if that's right. No, you're good. All right. I'm good now or I'm not good now? <laughs> no, you're fine. Okay, thank you. All right, a lot of wonderful people out there. You turned it wrong. All right, I was fine before. Okay, there we go. And then when I go down the paint, so don't go away. I'm going to be painting with you, but I got so much to share with you. All right, so if you want to paint, um, I'm going to be here for you. And we're going to paint and have a good time. So I want you to know I have something cool. You go to onestroke.com, my website, onestroke.com. 
All right. And when you go to this one um, all you do is um, it looks backwards. No. Okay. Um, you go to Westo.com and on the top, there's a pink banner. If you click it, it will tell you about this new class. All right. So this is called Discover One Stroke Lesson. All right. It's a special thing I've never done before. It's for all you guys who just want to jump in and try this. These are great to teach. These are great, great to just do yourself. Five projects in three days. And this is what we're doing. It's one hour class on October 5th, October 6th, and October 7th. So one hour class each day, and we are going to do greeting cards and different fall and just during the season uh, items here. So we're going to do two cards and envelopes that are more Christmassy, two that are fall, and then we're going to do this charger, and it is going to be pine cones, pine needles, a little bit of snow on there, and some fall leaves. Now, this is the thing. If you, you can also order the surfaces with the paints and brushes and everything, but this five project class, one hour each day, we're going to finish each day. We're going to finish what we start. Um, it's $20. So all you do is go click that pink banner on onestar.com and it's $20 to do this. All right. So the fun thing about this is if you want the surfaces, which come with paint and brushes and everything, plus the lesson, it's also on there where you can see what that is. So that's one important thing I want to share with you, how to get to onestar.com on, um, is how you find all the places I'm going to be. Also on this site, something that's coming up, I really want you to know, uh, be available if we purchase, but can't show up live. Oh yes. There's a recording of all those lessons. Okay. Um, so give me thumbs up. She said, yay. Okay. So let me tell you what else. Anybody who's anywhere near Tennessee, um, we go to a mountain retreat up there and it's not as big as my convention. So it's a little bit smaller and it's real personable and we have a great time. And it is at Henry Horton State Park in Tennessee and the U.S. <laughs> okay. November 9th through the 11th. So go check it out. See what's there. And yeah, me, 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 Tanya, I'd love for you to be there. Um, so I'm sorry, Lee. We're going to miss some of you who can't be there. All right. Um, so let me see. All right. I told you about the discover one stroke lessons. I told you about how to get to one stroke.com, how to, and that's where you go in there and find say mountain retreat in the search bar and it'll take you there. All right. So this is what today's all about. I've got all kinds of stuff I want to show you, but this is what you get right now. This, uh, and you guys have been using it so good. So what you do for every $50 order you place. All right. $50 or more, every one that you place, you're going to get $10 off every $50 order or $50 or more order. Okay. So let me tell you what happens here. Um, it goes till September 23rd. So anything I'm showing you, anything that you would like, just go and check it out because this is a special deal. You're going to put YT for YouTube, 10 for $10. See that's a zero and then an O. 10 off. All right. I'm going to make these numbers way easier from now on, but right now that's what I'm, I'm going to share with you. Um, and so I'm going to show you brushes and all kinds of things I'm going to use today as I'm painting. Miss Linda, we missed you when you left your picture in the studio. <laughs> all right. So what I want to share with you is that we have all kinds of good stuff that are right there on that site and I'm going to paint. So don't go anywhere. I'm going to show you a couple more things before we start painting. All right. These are the brushes that everybody's buying. All right. This is the most used pack. This is a value pack and it's the 10 most Donna Dewberry brushes most used on it that I use the most. And it's number 1059, but they are less than $20. Like I think they're like 18 or something. And then you got that $10 off when you spend 50. So that's one set of brushes. And this is the best brushes that I have. So good, better, best. I have some good brushes. I've got something on my glasses. Sorry. I've got um, good, better, best. I've got some that are good. Your brushes are great. Thank you. These are better. 
These are the ones I have two sets all the time. So one thing about that, not that I just want to sell you a bunch of brushes, but when you have your brush loaded with flower colors and then you want to jump over and use leaf, paint some leaves because then you're going to go back to flowers. You don't have to wash it out. So you're not throwing away all that paint. So you can have two of them loaded at the same time. And when I'm on, when I was on the shopping channel all the time, they would go magic. She took that brush and it was pink and white. And then also she picked up the brush and it was green and white. I had two brushes going. <laughs> so I just want you to know that those are on my side. And oh, and by the way, I just want you to know something. We are not Amazon. We are a family owned business and we cannot. This is very important. We cannot get it out in two days. We can't. And guess what's happened since I came to YouTube? Well, it's been crazy. So my YouTube lives. I want you to understand our Facebook lives. We take two to three weeks. All right. Because we get this crazy amount of orders in all at once. Well, right now on Shopify, I'm not Shopify, on onestroke.com. Right now on onestroke.com, our orders are hitting uh, triple what we've ever had on there. So that's, I mean, I'm literally telling you the truth. So it's crazy. So we hurried up all week and we ordered tons of stuff in. So they're all coming starting Monday. A big shipment came yesterday. So I don't, I don't want you to We have a bunch of you that are going like, what's wrong? I ordered that a day and a half ago. Why is it not shipped? And so you're going to have to give us a couple of weeks. And I understand if you don't want to do that, but I'm just saying, um, don't be mad at us. This is what we are. <laughs> We're not a huge, big company. We're family owned and we put out the product right from my own Dewberry U Studios. All right. So um, just let us know if you can't wait for it. Okay. Um, now, so I'm going to be showing this over and over. This is a special that's going on right now. And lots of people taking advantage of it, which is exciting. Now, one thing I'm going to show you before we start painting, then I'll come show you some more specials that are really good for you to look for on my site. Okay. Uh, family owned is awesome. And you guys are great. Thank you. Uh, I uh, thought you were magic brushes. I know I do have kind of magic on some things. All right. So this is what I want you to say. Together we are one. And so we are a great big Dewberry family. I have seven children. They don't all work for me anymore, but I have seven children that are now having their children. So, but I want you to know that I have lots of friends and family that help us make everything happen. Um, and we, all my ladies and guys that are out there, that will help me post up, you know, websites and stuff. So you guys can see it. It's because we all love each other and we work together. So we can tell when you don't know us <laughs> because we're going, okay, they're really unhappy. Mostly if anybody's really unhappy with our company it's because they can't get what they want. And so we're trying to make sure that doesn't happen to you. Okay. So I have a kit that is, my kit for the year with the paint company and it is the super deal right now so what people are doing it they're getting this a to z of flower painting a one stroke flower painting and they are there it is and it is all inclusive and when you take the ten dollar off people can if you're not, if you're new out there and you want to do one stroke with me and you're just saying this is so much fun where do I get started because we hear that all the time this comes perfect for you all right so it's a wooden box that you can paint but it stores these brand new brushes these are hot new brushes and 50 teaching guides all right but there's more all right wait there's more all right this is an amazing kit because let me explain something to you you can go to donna dewberry at plaid on youtube not my channel here but donna dewberry with plaid like the plaid plaid which is the paint company and you can watch all 50 of these short lessons so you would for free so you can get this the aster all right that's what you're going to paint and it's got a UV coat so you can practice right on top of my strokes. You paint it, you wipe it off, and you paint it again till you feel comfortable. It tells you the brush, the paints, and everything, and the video for free that goes with it. And then you turn it over, and you can lay tracing paper or whatever, or you can just start painting right on here. All right? Uh, that design. Don't paint on here. Leave it. All right? So, look. 
there's 50 different ones of every kind of flower from A to Z. All right. So to do that, I wanted you to have all the brushes. Now this whole kit, I think is $64 or something like that. And it gives you the set of brushes that I just talked to you about. It, no, it doesn't. It gives you these brushes. I don't know why those are in there. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just surprised myself for a minute. All right. It gives you these brushes. These are really nice, beautiful new brushes. There's an angle brush, a two scope liner, the brush I use the most, the flat and the three quarter and the 12 and a natural hair scruffy. High quality, beautiful brushes. All right. People are jealous of these brushes. All right. Those brushes paint all 50 of the design. Excuse me. You get the floating medium that you're going to see me using a lot. And you're going to get 10 colors of the multi-surface big bottles. All of that for like 64 something. Okay. That is the kit that I recommend if you are just starting or if you've been painting and you want more. There you go. Download them to your, your computer. Yeah, you can download all those 50 lessons, but they're there. The lessons are there and they're always staying there right there at Plaid. So then you can watch it over and over. And if you watch it over and over, it shows Plaid, the paint company, that you like me. Just like we like, we like you, the 31 thumbs up. That's good. We like you to give thumbs up because it's telling YouTube that this is something that you really like, right? Tell us the difference in the brushes. All right. So my brushes are, these brushes, um, Katie, are really good same brushes that I use every day but it's got this nice new handle I did a heavier a bigger handle and it's got a beautiful coating on it so this will paint on anything that we normally paint on but I want you to know my brushes are made not like other craft brushes out there when you use my brushes they've got they're more dense and they spring when you when you need to lift they lift with you okay so that's a good note thank you Katie for reminding me Okay, so let's start painting. I'm going to paint with the witch's hat and I'm going to throw in a couple little details here and there. Uh, so I want you don't leave because I don't want you to miss what's going to happen. Um, but I, if I don't stop, start painting, then you guys go away. So I don't want you to go away. Okay. All right. So I'm going to turn this down and I know I'm going to be upside down for a minute. But if you've been with me before, you know what that means. Why is that doing that? Wait a minute. Okay, we're going to come up and make sure that we can get that whole witch's hat. It's upside down. Give me a second. And I'm going to flip it. And there we go. And am I right-handed for you guys? Tell me if I'm right-handed. I got this set and I am working through the flowers. That's awesome. So this is what I tell you to do. If you want to become a teacher... If you want to teach, you have the paints and these guys to start with. I'm left-handed. Okay, so I'm going to make it right-handed. Where am I? There we are. So now I'm right-handed, right? Okay, thank you. All right, so then this is what I want you to know. Okay, so brushes are good now. All right, so... If you take these 50 lessons, this is for all of you who have been painting for a while. This is a perfect way to start lessons and get people painting with you. If you take out two lessons at a time, charge $25 or whatever, and teach them how to paint those two flowers and every lesson, you have 25 lessons all prepared for you right there. So think about that. Makes really good classes. And... And if you get somebody who wants to come to a bunch of classes, get them to buy their own kit and they have all the supplies to do it with you. OK, now I took a pencil and just kind of drew out this the this fun little hat. All right. Come on. Uh, all right. So what I'm going to do is I have my double loader here. Now, this is fun. This is what we use when you're starting to paint and you're new at it. OK, you're double loading color. And then it, this is this is the double loader itself. Newbies really love this because the thing that you have the hardest time with is double loading. And then this will pop on top of this. This is the palette, which I put foam plates or I put um, these plates in it. 
uh, I have film plates here somewhere. Anyway, so I match up these notches, put this on there, dampen this, and leave this in there with the lid. And what happens is your paint stays damp for like up to 30 days or so. All right. So I'm I'm going to just show you that this and and the brush basin is the brush basin keeps it matches all this. These are your tool set, and this will keep your brushes good and lasting for a long time. All right. So I just wanted to show you that. And so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to start with the hat itself and we're going to fill in. I'm going to step here so, so it doesn't have shine too bad. Old, older grandkids laugh out loud. My, mine are at high school and older. Okay. All right. So I'm damping my brush. You wet it. Put it on the paper towel. Then I'm going to come right here with licorice and gray. And I'm going to work that in. Medium gray and licorice. Okay. So I want you to see that I'm going to come around here. All right. So I'm going to take my little finger. Can you see my finger? All right. I hope you're liking this. We're going to show you how fun it is. This is on art paper. Okay, so when I'm on art paper, it's just because I paint so often. Sometimes I do that instead of a canvas, but you can. Somebody says, have you ever tried canvas, Donna? <laughs> I do lots of canvas painting. I just want you to know that I am um, using this paper just because it's already got a background color on it. And during... If you join my membership right here on YouTube, um, we do paint on canvases one a week for $9.99 or $9.95, one a week. Um, you get to learn all sorts of landscapes and different painting. And so I'd love for you to come try it. And But don't forget, we've got Patreon too. Patreon helps you. If it's Mark and I, my husband and I, and we teach you the business aspects, how to improve yourself personally with art, all kinds of different paths there. Plus, I do painting classes that are, are slower. Love the black cat you did a few years ago. I know that's fun. Thank you. All right. So do you see how I'm coming in here? I'm using medium gray. We're double loading. So this, that this gray right here, I'm keeping to the outside edge. Okay, so this isn't the fun part. Just wait till I decorate this baby. All right, so we're going to come right along here. Okay. And we want movement in here. So see, I can come along here. Put a little bit of movement in here. Now you can use some white too if you want there we go lots of paint all right so what you're seeing is a little witch's hat all right i will be meeting four of those kids for christmas gifts kim that's awesome that is awesome all right we just got we sold so many of them it's crazy so we we got a whole bunch shipping in. Some already showed up and some more are coming next week to fill all the orders. So it's the best way for you to start a beginner's kit with me. And if you're a seasoned painter, you're going to love it too. Because the people, people like most about my technique is that you can do flowers. And flowers with most technique are the hardest thing to paint. With my technique, because I love flowers, it was the easiest thing for people to learn. So people would go, it was so funny, it took me forever to create a rose that looks like a rose. And the people would say, oh, I already can do the rose because of my teaching guides. I can already do the rose. This is what I want to learn. And I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> All right. So... I'd love to inspire you. I'd love for you to share what you want to see next. I'd love for you to join our membership and ring the bell because what I've started doing, this is the first time we did it, I think, yesterday. 
uh, uh, Teresa Ship Shipsy made us a calendar with pictures. And so what I did is I had my assistant, Michelle, send that out right here on um, YouTube if you ring the bell, all right, when you sign up. You ring the bell and say, hey, I want to know when Donna's coming on. So when we want to send you something, it will go to you by us putting it in the community. Okay. All right. So there we go. Now, now I'm going to put a color for, I, got, I pulled out some fall colors. Can you see? Let me put these right in here. All right. There we go. Now I put the floating medium in the middle. That's what we need instead of water. I'm going to come in here with a 16 flat. The 16 is not in your set of 10. This is in the bigger set, but you can order the 16 separately. It's not very much money. All right. And that makes it really nice. So I'm going to, uh, come on. I ran my battery down, so <laughs> it's not being good to me. All right. So what I want to show you is let's put down in here an autumn color. This is Pueblo. All right. Now all of this is wonderful. Now when this is done, it's going to be shiny. You can paint clay pots. You can paint ceramics, mirrors, all kinds of surfaces. Okay. Shoes. Don't go away. Okay. So now I can come in here and put a couple of colors on here. Look, I can even come in here and do white. All right. Now I am going to let that dry. So I'm going to keep painting. Um, I thought it would be kind of cute to do a feather. So we might do a crow feather. What do you think about that? So this is a 16 flat. So I'm going to pick up the licorice and I'm going to come right along here. Let's get more paint. So pull, pull. Look, I got to go in medium. Now work that in. Now it'll go like butter. We want this to feel like butter. So if it doesn't feel like butter, it means you need more paint, more paint, or you need floating medium. So lots of paint, more paint. People say, wow, that's more paint than I ever thought. Okay, so I'm going to come here and do this feather. See how I'm pulling it down? All right, so I'm going to give it a little bit of white in here, and then I can pull. Let's just do a little bit of white here, a little bit of white there. I thought that would go with that witch's hat, right? And so it kind of looks like the crow. Let's put it, see it's dry, so I need the medium. It's dry because it's on paper. But the same paint will go on glassware. I get dishes, chargers from the dollar store. You paint on chargers, all kinds of different things. Now see, I'm just going to come here. Touch, pull, pull. And then pull the center of the feather. All right. But yeah, it's easy. So that's why I'm excited to share with you. All right. This keeps going away. Stop it. And I have paint on my finger, so it won't open it up. Sorry. All right. So I'm going to put a big flower here. And then some fall leaves and a spider. So let's wash this. Oh, let me let me go ahead and put this liner here and show you. All right, I'm gonna pick up the licorice, and this is the only time I use water is with a liner. Okay. And I've got a one here that I just okay. So now look what happens here. I'm gonna come right across here. Oops. Darn it. I touched it. All right. And I am going to put a spider web there. Okay. So I'm going to come down here and make it get all the way down. Spider webs are fun. I like to do this on kids' faces from the corner of their eye. 
and then they then we have a spider hanging um, um, black widow with a red body okay so here's a little bit of spider web all right so and then i can put it in the corner too but then what i want to do i got a little wet here i'm going to come around the hat all right now watch my little finger i'm going to pull it straight down and it's inky so i don't know if it's got enough of water in it to make it come all the way down okay now i'm going to take the handle of the brush and do the body i dip dotted the handle of the brush okay and now i'm going to do creepy legs <laughs> so oh, i keep touching the edge of that and it's getting black on my arm there we go so we're going to come up here with the spider legs and then we're going to go one, two, one, two, and then we're going to come down. All right. So we need water. All right. Now what's going to happen is that this one's going to come across here. This one's going to come across and then down, I'm gonna get black all over my shirt. So remember they need eight legs. All right, he's kind of creepy, right? All right, so this paper is very dry, but anyway, there we go. We can also put a little bit of white here to give it a little highlight and just a teeny bits of white here and there on it okay so now i'm going to take my three quarter inch the big brush that i base coated in okay and i'm going to wet it and then what we're going to do is do a big flower here now i can do a, a black and white flower that would be cool too but i've decided i'm doing apple red and june berry so i'm going to work this in Apple, red, and Juneberry. All right, so I could even put a little bit of licorice in the Juneberry and then have bright red here. So right here, look at what's going to happen. Look how that covers the, the licorice. We're going to keep picking up red. See how I worked it in right here? So you split the brush here in the double loader, and then you work it in. Uh, he needs another set of legs, okay? One, two, three. Okay, but it's giving me a bad time, so give me a break. I'll do it. <laughs> All right. I never painted the spiders easier than I thought. Oh, no, I can do. I can also shadow them when I put them on kids' faces and all, and it looks realistic. It's really kind of spooky and fun. When I went to Japan, um, all, the, all the girls that were working, painting, teaching with me, they all wanted me to put the spider webs on their face and do the spiders. And their bosses all said, no, they won't like face paint. So I said, okay. And so I, we just put roses on us and they go, oh, I want, I want, I want. All right. So do you see how I'm adding this in here? So it is what's ever on the edge of this brush in the corner. All right. So look, that rich. Tell me, are you liking it? All right, so I guess I've got to correct my spider. Okay, so I'm going to come right in here again. Cross over. Why am I shaking? Darn. All right, so we're going to come down here. I, it's not usually dry because I don't usually do this on paper. We do fun wine glasses with spider webs and spiders. All right, are y'all happy? <laughs> okay. All right. So now I can come over here and do a little bit of a rose bud. See this? And I'm using that big three-quarter inch brush. 
See, I did the purple. It's June berry. It's not purple. It makes a beautiful flower. But I need that little bit of dark. That makes the spider more creepy. <laughs> yeah. A teeny fancy for a little for a witch. I know. But I wanted to do something fun and not just do normal everyday stuff right so now i need a 16 i told you that's the brush that you have to buy separately I, uh, the, a lot of people don't like that big big brush they like a smaller brush okay so i want to show you that i'm gonna get a couple of colors here if it's not next to each other then i could dip this one dip this one and come here this is citrus green and autumn leaf or pueblo okay so we're going to come up here now watch what happens here i'm going to go up this is going to be the leaf it's all double loaded on this side i'm going to take the green out see how i'm curving we'll do a maple leaf all right so we're going to come right here right here and we're going to do the same thing here up down and we're going to come right in here and put a teeny bit of licorice okay so then let's pick up a little bit of red on let's come right across here and we're going to put some fall with some some pueblo with some red Okay, so Pueblo and red. All right, is that kind of fun? Now I'm going to pick up right in here. Let's pick up white and yellow. I'm going to pick up the two Pueblo and yellow colors, daffodil yellow. Okay, so. All right. Okay. See how the dark stays in the middle or the darker shade. Then I can come right in the middle and clean it up. Hello from Boston, Massachusetts. Hello, hello. All right, so we can come in here and I'm going to pick up this and Okay, now sometimes you want to put purple in here, which is, Juneberry is not purple, but it's got pretty, really pretty color. Makes very pretty berries. All right. All right, so see, we got some bright colors here. And I'm going to come in here in between. Listen, you don't even have to br uh, wash your brushes out. You can just keep picking up the next color. June. Uh, so we're going to get citrus and sap green. All right. And I'm going to come right here and stroke this. We're going to come right here and work it in. So you split it with your picking up colors and then you work it in. And an area that's not. Okay. All right, so now I want to come out here with different stems and we can put some different little flowers. Are you liking it? Is it bright? <laughs> Thank you. So I'm hoping that you guys like it. We're trying to figure out just some little fun Halloween decor for your house you can make this as a welcome sign you can paint this on a t-shirt there's all kinds of ways that you can use when i'm sharing with you each time i paint i'm telling i'm showing you i did this on paper just so that we could do it really quick today but think about all the different places things that you could paint this on all right now, we go to dollar tree and get a lot of pieces 
All right, so we got a spider, a spider web, we got a wicked hat. Uh, that green makes it pop. Yeah, so I thought that bright green on there. Um, then we'll put some little blossoms. And look, this June berry is yummy. So I can just take the handle of the brush and dot some little berries on here and little berries in here. So, oh, oh, I messed that up. That's okay. I'll find a way to help or fix it. See, it doesn't look good unless you have fresh paint. Fresh, 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 fresh. All right. So now I'm going to wipe that off the handle so I don't get it all over me. But um, I got purple right here, the June berry. So I can stroke right back over that. Now I do want to come in here with a smaller brush. Let's just use an eight or a 10. I mostly use flat brushes. So think about that when you're seeing the color, the sizes of brushes that I have. I'm going to take and make little leaves and I'm going to put some little teeny flowers in here. Okay. Are you liking it? Good horrific. Oh, it would be. That would look wonderful. So we have glitter, glitterific. We have dragonfly glaze. All these, all these that we could put right over. Thank you, right over the black hat before you start painting. Even so, if you go to my site, when you go to my site, be looking for glitterific, extreme glitter, all kinds of different ways. Um, I love, I've got, you can make black out of color stuff and um, do fun things with it. Oops. Okay. So we've got some black feathers. We'll get another black feather in here. Now I'm going to come in here and there's this little fuzzy scruffy brush that comes in your, in the kit. Um, uh, and the set of brushes, I mean. So look, I'm going to hit Juneberry, hit it. I'm going to pounce it. Do not wet this brush first, okay? So are you happy yet? Uh, have you learned something new? Okay, so I'm going to take and, oops, I'm going to pounce little clusters of fun June berry oh these are look pretty orange too I didn't bring any orange I just did an orange band oh I do have some orange there's some in the leaves right so autumn leaves I do all kinds of real pretty leaves all right so then I just want you to see that we could just put all that on there pop of fun and we can also put another creepy spider in here, but I think that was enough. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to do a few little curls. All right, so if I come in here, the citrus and some white, wicker white and citrus. All right, we're going to come here and... Oops. And we can have this on top. I was going to put this on a pumpkin hat as I had on the pumpkin. Um, but because of time, I thought I'm just going to do this real quick. There. Real quick and show you how fun it is to just add a few flowers, a few leaves. And just enjoy yourself. Isn't that kind of fun? There we go. All right, so let me show you what else I've got going here. All right, so stay here just for a minute so I can uh, share with you all you new people. Let me show you something. We're gonna, we can paint some more, but I want you to know that's the website to go get all the product. And what I have right now is 
two new online lessons for Zoom that you could get on there. One is this one. Whoa, there. All right. So what this is, is I'm going to paint it on a canvas and here it is on a pillow. So this Zoom lesson is right there online. It's a fall wreath with birds with chickadees. This lesson's on there. Um, and you get the recording, you get the picture, you get the pattern emailed to you, all that's emailed to you. And this is the online lesson for fall wreath. Okay. And then you have a different answer, but I'm thinking your surface is dry and you may need to add some photo medium. Oh yes. Well, I need water when I'm using the script liner. That's the deal. All right. So this is a table full of fall. And I teach you chrysanthemums. I was going to do burgundy, deep burgundy red roses. But I wanted you to see that I'm I'm doing um, washes over this. I'm teaching you the wreath, the little pine needles, the candles, um, all of this in a lesson, that, which is also in September. It tells you the date, tells you when it is. If you can't be there, you're going to learn all these candles and candle holders and wicks and everything. Um, and you get the recording and you can watch it over time to get new brushes. If you have lost your chisel edge. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Gilbert. I appreciate that. So this is called table of fall table, a fall table. Ugh, I can't even talk. So we're using stencils, all kinds of things that we're going to learn in this one. All right. So this is a fall one. And we're going to do all kinds of colors. And this is the other fall one that I'm offering. These both were added. These are both for the end of September. So go check out those dates. I think it's the 21st and the 27th. If you can't be on, you still get the recording. But I email you all the paint list, the full size patterns, and um, the picture photographs. So you can see this has glitter on it. Can you see? This was the cover of a magazine and last time everybody said, I want this, I want this. Instead of making a packet, it's easier to teach it to you and give you all that uh, email, that stuff to you. All right. So check that out. These are three EDU classes that are packets also. These are on there. You can buy each one. Um, these are, I actually taught on One Stroke Advantage right here on, on YouTube. These are three lessons that are available already on here but what we've done now is we made the packets for you they're $14.95 or you can get all three together i think it's $29.95 but you also have your ten dollar coupon so um i want you to see this is what you get in an edu pack this is if you want to teach and i'm always encouraging you guys to teach what you're going to get in here is you're going to get the simple step outs really clear for a beginner. All right. This is for the teacher to teach. And that's the final picture. All right. They're usually only 11 by 14. This is to read so you know how to teach it. And then you get six of these to teach six people. Or you can teach 12 and the two can share. And then you can collect them and teach again. And then you get six patterns. So just printing this if you have to go to a printer. Just printing this uh, would cost you more than that. So I'm doing all the work for you because I know if you go out and teach, the more people do one stroke with us. All right. So this is how each packet is. If it's an EDU pack, it's there. And also you can get the video and the printouts on Patreon for three classes that I did in the past. If you join Patreon, you can go check those out. That's a new class I started doing. All right. And then um, and then there's more. This is a brand new pack we just put up. So this packet has both of these paint. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It's got this one and this one in there. Sorry. This one and this one. So they're a bonus pack. You get both of these in the packet. So anyway, that's uh, uh, packets are packets are made so that you can trace them, use them, save them. Let me show you. This is what happens. See this plastic sleeve? It has all the how-tos and what you need, but I want you to see. I don't want to get, I'm going to paint a few more things on here. All right, so look at this. 
you're putting this in there and you're going to take that plastic and stroke right on top of the plastic and wipe it off and do the next step. And the arrows, it shows you arrows and what steps, steps next. Queen Anne's lace. And then how to put them together. A big close-up picture. And then this is the cosmos. So we're going to do the background and then all the flowers step by step. All right, close-ups of each one of them and your final picture and then double patterns and that's when you get two sets all right two different ones so now this is what every packet is so if you go online on one stroke.com you get that ten dollars off of any fifty dollar order that you put in fifty dollars or more okay so here it is especially for you newbies if you've never tried this please go try it your code that you put in when you check out is yt 10 off all right so you enter it at checkout and this is only good till september 23rd so i just want you to see that and what you need to get done for that to happen all right is to put it in i just showed you all kinds of product i'm going to come around here and add just a little bit more because i did a smear there so i can come in here with the licorice all right. Thank you for being on with me tonight. This is what I do during Facebook lives. And I want you to know that I paint something different each time. I hope you guys saw my jack-o'-lantern. It's we got um, over 4,000 subscriptions from that one jack-o'-lantern. Um, it's the pumpkin with some flowers and I also have specials on each one of those, so you can go, you can go watch that and ch and check it out if you want to. I had tons of people found me that hadn't seen me in years by watching that, so that was awesome. And there you go. See how we can just add little bits to it and make it really special. Um, I also wanted. I got black paint in here now in my water, so it's not as friendly. All right. I also did um what are we going to do let's pick up this with some pueblo and we're gonna work this in okay so look what happens here we're gonna put a few little flowers in here it's nice to be on with you guys friday nights <laughs> we don't usually go out friday night so this is a nice thing for me I'm going to come down so closer so you can see. All right. So what I do once a week is usually Monday nights. I teach projects from landscapes. You can go see them on our community and see what they're like. And I try to do whatever's in the season. Then I do some landscapes. We've done how to draw a face and do other fun things that uh, that you can do with one stroke that you might not know you can do with one stroke. Okay. And I do a lot of specialty flowers. Okay. So what I'm going to do to this now is I have all kinds of tools and I share with you how to use those tools. And I'm most popular if you go back and look at that Jack the Lantern live, I show how to do stencils and how fun those are to add to your project like i did in that project that i'm doing um, that i just shared with you guys for september but i'm going to come in here and show you that i do this stencil i had a small one too i wanted to show you did i bring it up here now all right so i can if you're not sure about where to put leaves and how to put leaves this is pretty wet, so I'm going to be careful doing this. But I, I have these new stencil brushes, too, that you will love. There's a set of those on there. Okay, and we sold out. Nice. We got more coming in right now. Okay, so I want you to see that um, if you're not sure where to place your leaves, okay, I don't want this to get on my piece. All right, so I'm going to go in, and you just want the tip of the stencil brush to get paint on it but not more than the tip okay i'm going to rub it off and then i'm going to come right here and this will show you could use a lighter color 
you're going left and right, left and right, and it'll go right in there. And what's really good about these brushes, I don't have to tape anything off or worry about it because I can control it because it's synthetic nylon and it stays right there for you. All right. So that helps you. Now you could go and you know where to paint those leaves. Okay. Makes it really easy for you. All right. So I'm going to, I can't really go there because those little dots are very wet. So I can come right down here and we'll do some black again. And you see, I'm wiping it off on here. And then I'm going to come right in here. Okay, I'm going to go off the edge, left and right. Wax on, wax off. <laughs> okay. Okay, both ways. I'm just doing licorice right now to show you. All right, so it just gives you a little bit. And I would put one over here too. All right. And we can also put a spider web up in the corner. I didn't think it could get any other cuter, but that does make it cute, doesn't it? All right. So the spider is kind of fun. And I got that space up there. Anyway, I love these all over prints like this. I'm just going to put it up there since I got some junk up there I'm not happy about. All right. And so we're using black because it's the accent in this painting. Okay, so we have bigger brushes too. The set of three, oops, that's moving around. The set of three is a 12, a 16, and a 20. And that 20 is amazing. Okay, so they're super deal of price on there. So go check them out. All right. So see, I can go there and just touch a little bit where... I smudged it with my fingers. Are you liking it? It's got this sheen because the paint has it in there. All right. I have fun painting that. I've been wanting to paint this all day, so I hope you guys like it. Whatever you want to paint, Donna has a packet for it. Landscapes, seascapes, critters, buildings, flowers, butterflies, and angels. Aren't you sweet, Miss Linda? Uh, no, I'm loving it. So not too much, just fun. Right there, you could do a nice spider web in there. But I think we got enough, right? So thanks for the hearts on the thumbs up. I appreciate you guys. I hope that I taught you something. I'm excited to see you next time. Go do me a favor. I'm getting better at fixing my mistakes. Exactly, because we can cover them. All right. Do me a favor. Go check out my website while you've got this special deal. All right. So thank you for being on tonight. OneStroke.com, want a YouTube 10 off. All right. Thank you so much. I got paint everywhere. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.